How to find out the number of pus using Python. I want to know the number of pus on the local machine using Python. The results should be user slash real as output by time one when called with an optimally scaling user space only program. If you're interested into the number of processors available to your current process, you have to check CPU set first. Otherwise, or if CPU set is not in use, multiprocessing.cpu underscore count is the way to go in Python 2.6 and newer. The following method falls back to a couple of alternative methods in older versions of Python. If you have Python with a version is greater than or equal to 2.6 you can simply use this URL. Lenos.sked underscore get affinity zero is what you usually want. This URL. Os.sked underscore get affinity zero added in Python 3, returns the set of PUS available considering the sked underscore SATE affinity Linux system call, which limits which PUS a process and its children can run on. Zero means to get the value for the current process. The function returns a set of allowed PUS, thus the need for len. Multiprocessing.cpu underscore count and os.cpu underscore count on the other hand just returns the total number of physical PUS. The difference is especially important because certain cluster management systems such as platform LSF limit job CPU usage with sked underscore get affinity. Therefore, if you use multiprocessing.cpu underscore count, your script might try to use way more cores than it has available, which may lead to overload and timeouts. We can see the difference concretely by restricting the affinity with the task set utility, which allows us to control the affinity of a process. Minimal task set example. For example, if I restrict Python to just one core, core 0, in my 16 core system, with the test script main.py, then the output is versus NPROC. NPROC does respect the affinity by default and outputs
and ManProc makes that quite explicit. Print the number of processing units available. Therefore, lenos.sked underscore get affinity zero, behaves like MProc by default. MProc has the all flag for the less common case that you want to get the physical CPU count without considering task set. Alt.cpu underscore count documentation. The documentation of alt.cpu underscore count also briefly mentions this, this URL. This number is not equivalent to the number of PUS the current process can use. The number of usable PUS can be obtained with len alt.sked underscore get affinity zero. The same comment is also copied on the documentation of multiprocessing.cpu underscore count, this URL. From the 3.8 source under lib slash multiprocessing slash context.py we also see that multiprocessing.cpu underscore count just forwards to os.cpu underscore count, except that the multiprocessing one throws an exception instead of returning none if os.cpu underscore count fails. Three point eight availability systems with a native sked underscore get affinity function. The only downside of this os dot sked underscore get affinity is that this appears to be Unix only as of Python three point eight. Python three point eight seems to just try to compile a small C hello world with a sked underscore say affinity function called during configuration time and if not present have underscore sked underscore say affinity is not set and the function will likely be missing. This URL, this URL, shootle.process.cpu underscore affinity, third party version with a Windows port. The third party shootle package, pip install shootle, had been mentioned at this URL but not the CPU underscore affinity function, this URL. Usage This function does the same as the standard library os.sked underscore get affinity on Linux, but they have also implemented it for Windows by making a call to the get process affinity mask Windows API function. This URL, this URL. So in other words, those Windows users have to stop being lazy and send a patch to the upstream slip smile. Tested in Ubuntu 16.04, Python 3.5.2 Another option is to use the pseudo library, which always turn out useful in these situations. This should work on any platform supported by pseudal Unix and Windows. Note that in some occasions multiprocessing.cpu underscore count may raise a note implemented error while pseudal will be able to obtain the number of PUS. This is simply because pseudal first tries to use the same techniques used by multiprocessing and, if those fail, it also uses other techniques, 